this is a WordPress e-commerce website. We have a lot of different products and the products, which are mostly apparel, would have different attributes like sizes. So in the admin of the website, we would go to, to products, then click on attributes, and we can see in there, that's where we would add different attributes like sizes, colors, and things like that. So here we already have one set up that we called size. And when I click edit, we can see what I put in there. So we just put in the name, the slug, which is all lowercase letters, and that's about it. So it's very easy to add a new attribute. Then to use that attribute, you go to each individual product because every product has different types of attributes. For example, dresses might be size eight and 10, while shoes might be size five, five and a half and six. So you would use different size attributes and different color attributes for different products. In order to use these attributes, you have to set the product data to variable product, which I have here. Then we go to attributes, or actually we go to variations, and you can see two that I've already got set up here. So when I click, and you can see there's a drop down menu. When I click this menu, then you can see that we're able to set a quantity. So I could set the quantity as five for the size medium, and maybe I've got a different quantity for small and a different quantity for large. So the website will keep track of this. And we can put in regular price, a sale price, a weight, and the dimensions of the box if we wanted to. And then if I want to add this variable, I just select it from here and then click Add Variation. And that's all I have to do to add sizes to a product.